Yo, what's up, y'all? I'm Blue Keeping you subscribe and welcome to the content. If you've seen this, I can't really bend my fingers, so when I was doing this, I couldn't really do it well. Um, I did some stupid shit, and that's why it's like this, but... Uh, I'm kind, I'm kind of like, you know, upset today, uh, because I got a problem, bro. I got a problem. Um, so this is my journal, right? Uh, and I've been writing in this thing from, I can say last year. I started last year, November, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, I started last year, November, and I've been writing, like, consistently, right? Like, I didn't miss a day. November, I didn't miss. December, I didn't miss. January, I didn't miss. But a couple of days in February, that's when I was, like, becoming inconsistent. And that's because I, I was, like... I don't know, I was hit by a lot of emotions that were just making me feel down for no reason. Like, I literally had no reason to feel that way, but I just did. Or maybe because I've been, like, trying so hard to be consistent, that's maybe, like, draining me. That's really causing me to, like, you know, forget that I'm human and, and I need to calm down. But in my mind, in my mindset, it's just like, bro, I can't be sleeping. I can't be relaxing. I can't be thinking about other things. I can't be distracted because I got so many goals that I want to achieve. And I feel like I'm always, like, on a time limit. Like, I might have, you know, you know an am abundant amount of time, but it's just like... I want to be able to just be in the process or just have my mind in something I really want to do and that's content creating and it's just like I'm so absorbed into that that I forget that I'm draining myself you know that I need to relax sometimes I need to calm down and it might take a toll on my body or my mind and my mental and I think writing in this was really helpful because I was doing self-reflection every single day of just how I was feeling my goals and you know just how everything was going and I'm upset because uh, recently it got wet, you know, the, the cover is messed up, you can see, and there was water all inside the pages, I don't know if you can see the, the water, um, yeah, it's right here in the margin, it's, it's really messed up, it's just like, I've been writing in this thing so much, my dreams, my hopes, my life, the way I'm feeling, it's just like, there was a lot of things that, maybe if I wasn't feeling right, writing this made me feel a hundred times better, it motivated me, it made me feel more disciplined, it made me focus on my goal, like, when I got distracted, writing this thing just put me straight on track, and it's just, like, I'm not going to stop writing in it just because it's damaged, but I just feel like, you know what, it, it's, I feel like I'm trying to cheat you a lesson in a way. It's like sometimes some things will happen in your life where you will reach, like, you know, a problem where something that you like or something that you're doing will will kind of, like, hit a stop, you know what I'm trying to say? Like, there'll be an obstacle in your way or there'll be something or a situation where, you know, you are now forced to take, like, a step back or stop exactly where you are and then you're, like, wondering how do I move forward. For me... It was here, you know what I'm trying to say, like writing in this thing consistently, it just, it was just so cool, you know, I don't, I don't care what other people think about, you know, writing and journaling and, you know, expressing your fear, uh, expressing your, your, yourself, but for me, this, this was really important, you know what I'm trying to say, it literally just kept my mind, like, so, so focused, and I'm upset that it got damaged, but it's not completely damaged where I can't stop writing in it, I'm still gonna completely, I'm gonna completely, like, I literally have, I'm literally more than halfway, you know, over this book so it's just like i got a couple pages and then i get a new one and what i want to say is that bro things will happen in your life where you like have to stop or where something that you really value gets damaged something that you hold really close to you and it's got to be like where you look about where you look back on how much you've actually been growing like i've been consistent with this thing like since first of november and it's just like i've been doing this for so long and i'm just like I'm proud of it, you know, like, even though it got damaged, it got wet, I'm proud of how far I've gotten, like, I look back and it'll be like, damn, I really worked consistently, like, trying to make content consistently and writing in this thing consistently, it's just like, I've done so much that I should be proud of that this one thing should not, like, ruin it, it should not, like, end it all, you know what I'm trying to say, so it's just like, I appreciate how much I actually am focused, how much I actually am dedicated to this thing it just means so much more to me it just means like i really know how to you know make things that i really want in my life very important and i know how you know i can determine what is good for me and what i want and what i want to pursue and what i want to go after in my life so it's just like with these you know qualities and these habits that i'm trying to adopt into my life and trying to you know learn because i'm not saying i'm someone who you can take advice from i'm trying to learn and while i'm learning i'm sharing so i really value the things that i learn i really value the things that i am experiencing the the things that i go through and that's why i try to share this with you guys maybe you've been into you know these type of situations you can relate to me who knows but you know, as I keep on going, I'll just keep on journaling, I'll just keep on recording, you know, like these, these videos will be very important for me in the future just to look back and be like, you know, 
I've gone through so much and I'm just so happy that I'm in, I'm at, I'm in this position where I'm just like, you know, I'm so free, I'm so happy, I'm so determined. I'm, I'm still striving for goals, you know, like I might have reached some specific goals, but there's still something I'm thriving, you know, to do because as a human being, the goal is never ending, you know, you gotta keep on living until, you know, your last breath. And yeah, with this journal, after this one and the next and the next and the next because i'll be journaling for a long time even if i'm successful i still feel like after that i'm gonna still be journaling and you know no matter what happens to those experiences no matter what happens to the way i record these things i'll just keep on living in the moment and stop regretting that you know these things happen because it's behind me it's past me there's no way i can change it all i can do is focus on how i impact the presence to create a better future uh, other than that, y'all can see what I'm not saying. And I'll see you when I see you. Bye!